and happy, happy anniversary, Cinderella. Cinderella, 70 years of Disney Cinderella. Beautiful. And what way to celebrate her by having some cake. Cake, anyone? So I'm so excited. Um, she officially celebrated her 70th anniversary on February 15th of this year, 2020. And my channel wasn't up until not too long ago, but it's Cinderella's year. So any time is great to celebrate Cinderella or anything Disney. I am going to share some items I hold dear to me, and I'm going to try to keep it with a Cinderella slipper theme. And uh, let's get started. So I just thought it'd be really cute um, to show my first Cinderella porcelain doll. And I'm so proud of her. Actually, we used to have a Sam's Club here in uh, Toronto, Ontario. And my husband and I used to go there every week. We loved shopping there. And my husband actually spotted Cinderella. And um, I, all my dolls are standing up. So I thought, let's give Cinderella a break. <laughs> it is her anniversary after all. So I have her in a little seated position. And as you can see, I, I put her in a cross-legged position. And she's got that beautiful sparkling uh, glass slipper that she's showing. Now all I need to find is Prince Charming in a porcelain doll. Wouldn't that be so romantic with him bent here, placing his uh, slipper on her? It would be a beautiful thing. And so, as you can see, she's porcelain. And I this is my very first Cinderella doll. Um, I guess we've had her for hmm, maybe around 15 years, maybe. Unfortunately, Sam's Club's no longer here anymore, but we bought a few things from Disney at Sam's Club. And she's holding a mirror. Um, I don't remember her in the animated movie uh, with a mirror, but if anyone knows why the mirror is there, you can please feel free to let me know uh, on the comments. And um, so that's my very first item. And my second item, which actually has to be one of my favorites in dolls, believe it or not, is who better than the fairy godmother? I love her. She's so cute with the chubby cheeks. She's so cute. Actually, I'll let you know something about me uh, with a fairy godmother. Every time I watch this movie, I find myself so warmed by her voice. The fairy godmother's voice is so soothing and so consoling. What, like, like a grandmother's voice. Someone very comforting. Love that voice. Absolutely love it. And I actually never really saw a fairy godmother at the Disney store before, honestly. Um, I bought this at the Disney store in Scarborough Town Center here in Toronto. And uh, it's got to be a good 10 years since I've had her. And I haven't seen another fairy godmother um, since then. And um, maybe I just didn't look hard enough. <laughs> so that's that. And my next, as I mentioned, I'm going to try to stick with a Cinderella slipper theme. I have this beautiful glass slipper. Not sure if I'm doing any justice with it here by holding it, but it is a very heavy, substantial piece. I'm going to actually build a little display while I'm talking. I'm going to put it right here. And as you can tell, it is pretty heavy. It's glass. It is not from Disney. Um, I have been told that uh, I believe Disney uh, World sells the glass slippers, but it is a glass slipper and it's Cinderella inspired to me. And my husband and I went to, I think it was called, was it Winners? And we went to Winners and we saw that there and it was just beautiful. I thought, this is a Cinderella glass slipper. That's what I'm calling it. After that, um, my husband and I went to Niagara Falls, Ontario. I would say five, six years ago, maybe even more. And my husband's actually stopped. He stopped and saw this at a little boutique across from the Falls View Casino. Um, and it's so pretty. Again, it's not Disney. But I hold this dear, and I love anyone who knows me knows I love sparkle. Um, it is a crystal gold-plated um, ornament or keepsake. And what I do with this, I actually hang it off a curtain rod in the living room. And when the sun hits it, it looks so pretty and so sparkly. Um, I have so many compliments on this item. Love it. So let me see. I'm going to put it right here for you so you can actually take a look at that. And yes, it has wheels. It actually functions. Yay! <laughs> so that's that. And actually, I'm not sure if you noticed, I am wearing a Cinderella ring. It's a Cinderella castle ring. I don't have the most gorgeous nails. I'm very simplistic. <laughs> so that's that. And um, this was purchased at Hot Topic. Um, I believe the year that the live action movie was filmed. And uh, I love it. So I don't wear it all the time. I'm, I'm afraid of the color getting chipped and whatnot. So that is from Hot Topic. 
and it actually wasn't that expensive, but I just love it. And I love big things like that. It's just very, very unique. I love unique items. That's my Cinderella ring, which I hold dear to me. Now, moving on to the Cinderella slipper. I adore this top. Now, as I mentioned in my last video, I lost 101 pounds. So my doctor's scale says, <laughs> and, um, this I used to wear, as you can tell, it's quite big, but I love this top and I want to share that with you. This top I find it's just a scene. It's so romantic. I absolutely adore this top. You will see the prince. He's just ever so romantically and gently applying her shoe back onto her foot. If you want to say that scene and you see the clock, I believe there, um, hope you got a good shot of that. This also is from Hot Topic. Yes, Hot Topic has a lot of beautiful things. Uh, for, t for some time, they had a lot of Cinderella and Beauty and the Beast. I went crazy in there, and I gotta show you the back. Look at the back. Isn't that pretty? Let's see if you had a good glimpse of that there. It's the carriage and the horses. Isn't that beautiful? So as you're walking towards people, they see this. As you're walking away from them, they see that. And I can't tell you how many people complimented me on this, this tank top. Um, it's gorgeous, and I, I don't wear it all the time. Word of advice, my friends. Um, if you have a top like this that you really love or a garment that you really love, my number one suggestion would be hand washing it in cold water. Um, it, you just save it from pilling and it won't fade. Um, I love this. I love this. So that's part of my collection. I have something really, really special I'd like to share with you now. Um, we're going to have to shift over to another room and uh, come follow me. And we're back. This is my last piece of this presentation that I would love to show you, and definitely not the least. This is a chair, high heel shoe, <laughs> Cinderella inspired chair. Um, my husband and I bought this the year we got married. Um, it's been quite some time, and it's still brand new. We hardly use it. The minute we saw it, we were shopping around for some appliances and furniture, and the minute that I laid eyes on that, it was not this color, it was, I think, red. And I thought, oh, this is gorgeous. It's a Cinderella shoe, I'll turn it into a Cinderella shoe. It's beautiful, love it. And so we ordered it and we chose the color and the fabric, and I love it. Um, it's a very good conversation piece. <laughs> Life-size stiletto, <laughs> I call it Cinderella shoe. And uh, it's actually quite comfortable. <laughs> I wouldn't watch a, a long movie though with it. But um, this is my last piece that I want to share with you. And I hope that you enjoy it. And maybe I'll inspire you to finding something like this and adding it to your furniture in your home. Um, but I'm really happy, especially that uh, we're celebrating Cinderella 70th anniversary. And you know what? I have to say, God bless Walt Disney and congratulations to him because if it wasn't for him, we wouldn't have no Disney's Cinderella to celebrate and other beautiful, beautiful movies that he's uh, created. So I hope that you enjoyed this channel, this video, and I hope that you like and subscribe to my channel and continue on this journey with me together on this channel. And please look, uh, stay tuned for other videos that I will be dropping from time to time, hopefully sooner than later. And uh, I wish you happiness, friends, and bye for now.